So, 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 yeah, so you're not, yeah, I'm a real girl, not, yeah. Hey, 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 good okay. afternoon, people. Welcome to another edition of Peace, Love, and Modest and Respect. Um, we're here today on the road with Mr. Charles Road. And Mr. Charles Road, and we also are uh, Michael Road by, uh, what is this? Montgomery Avenue and Carmichael Road by the food stand. So we encourage everyone to come out and support the food business. Today we are taking time out to sit with Mr. Charles Roll, a senior citizen of this country who has um, been challenged with his disability. And I just want him to sit here and share a little bit of his life. Good day, Mr. Roll. All right. Good afternoon. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is my producer don't pronounce my name, but I can bring it back in the yard. My name is Charles Road, I'm 77, all right? I need help. I, get, I, I have love for, 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 for the society, all right? Now, I changed my life. I'm trying to, to bounce back. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm trying to bounce back, all right? They say I punish, all right? I believe in, in job. All right, I never finish. Just believe and I'll fight to, to jump. You ain't going, you ain't pass away. That's how fate you may be, you might be paralyzed, maybe couple. So what? I, excuse me, Mr. Roy, I noticed that um, you have your wheelchair is basically. No, wheelchair. All right, so, so people, all of those out there, who asks me what I need, I don't need anything. I'm here to try to, 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 to help Mr. Roll. So I'm asking people out there on social media or those who have a chance to watch this, help me to help him to get a wheelchair. I don't want any money. You don't need any money. All we need is for you to help us to help him to get a wheelchair. Alright, and Mr. Roll, today is Tuesday. By Friday, God spare my life and your life. Good afternoon. Right. Ladies and gentlemen, I respect that. You see my, you can say part, I do a part. Help me, please. Do you live on the streets? I don't live on the streets. Okay. I live on the streets. I live East Avenue, house number 75, after the white. Ask me now. Right. So please, ladies and gentlemen, can I charge you the best we can do? Because, I mean, it's, it, it, it's hurt my heart as a person with love in my heart, but not having the resources to do things for some people. And some people that help have the resources to help people, they just don't care. But this gentleman sitting on the side of me is basically crying, man, crying out for help. You know what I mean? And, and, and what else can we do? What else could me and Drift to do? The only thing we could do is bring the reality to the people and let the people explain that their life. But this reality behavior, people, this is what's going on in life. All right, we can't pretty part our show, we can't show or say something that's not reality. And and, and I'm glad to speak to, to, to Mr. Rose today so he can bring it from the reality aspect of it. You know I mean, Mr. Rose? Yeah, yes, sir. And I always want you to remember God ain't bring you this far to be you, my brother. And God's it's open for you, man. Like I say, for a Friday, that will be the chair of God's You see? Yeah, I see the condition of your wheelchair. Your wheelchair came along. So you can imagine a man like him who's disabled. He's going down the road to Breezy, right? And he can't even lock his wheelchair. The wheelchair just go riding. On one so side, he have no tire. On one side, don't have no tire. You know what I mean? And so, people, man, please, man, please. All right, I'm, I'm asking everyone in this country, and I have a lot of followers, even those abroad, to help me to get a wheelchair for this gentleman. So we can live a life, some kind of comfortable life. Like every one of us want to live a comfortable life. So before
before we close, give give some word of encouragement to the young people because I know you're older person in the country. I call when I say older people, I call y'all OGs, OGs or senior person. Give a word to to the young people. Um, a word of encouragement to stay on the right track, to live to see your age without being shot up, without being starved up, but everything that God was promised to you. I'm 63. Give a word of encouragement. Wow. Well, people. I cry so much for people in this country that I don't even have more, I, I, don't, I don't even have much more there just to rule. Listen to me. People don't know how passionate I is for my people. You understand me? It hurt me to hear when people don't have something, when people can find, don't have something to eat, but I know I can find it. Uh, Boy, being a forget ya. For those who get a chance to watch this today, my number is 819-9848. My number is 819-9848. So if you wanna if you wanna um help us with Mr. Rove and getting a wheelchair, uh. man, come on man, I have a lot of people out there who could afford a wheelchair. Come on, come on y'all people. Y'all know when y'all call on me anytime I there. I call it on some of y'all.